Hi, my name is David Finlay and I'm the Director of Recording for Master Swimming Queensland. In this video I'm going to demonstrate how you can submit your entries to Meets Online. So we're starting here on the Master Swimming Queensland website. On the right hand side, click on the link that says Member Forum. Now if you haven't used a Member Forum before, you will need to create an account. To do so, you can scroll down the page and on the left hand side click the link that says create an account. On this page you'll need to enter your full name then select a username. Now this username can be a nickname you use or a shortened version of your own name. It just has to be one word. You also need to enter in a password. It can be any length but make sure you write it down because you will need this each time you log in there. And you will need to enter that again in Confirm Password. After this you should enter your email address and then once again in Confirm Email Address. Now they do need to match now then the important part is, in the membership details section, you will need to enter your membership number and your club details. So I'll enter my membership number here, club name, and date of birth. Now the date of birth should be entered as year first, then month, then day. Now after that you click the register button there and your account will be registered. Now if there's any problems with the information you've entered, the system will tell you what you need to change. Now in my case I've already done this so I'm just going to cancel that. And so I've entered my username and password in here. And I'll select remember me and click login. Now on the left hand side under the main menu you'll see the option that says entry manager. So we click on that one and now there's an option that says enter a meet. Now in this meet I'll be swimming for Redcliffe Peninsula Masters Swimming. Now if I was a member of other clubs those clubs would be there for me to select from. It also gives me the list of the meets that are currently available for entries so I'll be selecting Moreton Bay Regional Swim Meet. Now I click next. So firstly if I wanted to add an order for an additional meal I could add that there. And then after that I can check the rules for the meet so it's saying I can enter for up to five individual events. And now I can select the tick, tick boxes beside each event that I want to enter. So I want to do the 400 freestyle. I'm going to do the 100 freestyle. I'm going to do the 200 butterfly, the 200 freestyle and the 50 meter freestyle. Now for the 400, in this case it's a postal so I'm not going to enter a time, I'm just going to select no time. For the other events, using the format it's indicated there, I can enter my time. So for 200 I'm going to put down a time of 3.15. For the 100 I'll put down 120, for the 200 I'll put down 305 and then for the 50 metre I'm just going to put down 32 seconds and it will automatically format those times for me. Now I'd like to swim in the relay as well so I'll click this option here for the relay and that will indicate to your club captain that you want to enter that relay and then they can decide whether they're going to put you in that when they formulate the relay teams. So after I've done that I'll press next and now I can confirm the details as I've entered them. So I can see here all my times are correct and it also tells me what fees I'm going to have to pay including any event fees or meal fees I may have to pay and the total cost. So now I know that's what I'm going to have to pay to my club captain. So once you're happy with that click the submit button and now it's taking me back to the My Entries page. So if I scroll down the bottom of this page here now, I'll see here I've got an entry for the Moreton Bay Regional Swim Meet. 
and I can see the details of my event entries. Now it's telling me my entry status at the moment is awaiting payment. So this will mean that the club captain is still waiting for me to pay for those entries. Once I do pay for those entries, the club captain will change it to say accepted. Then once the club captain has sent it to the meet organisers, it will then change to say sent. Finally, once the meet organisers have confirmed your entry, the status will change to confirmed, which means you'll know you're definitely on the program. So it's as simple as all that. If you have any issues, you can ask questions in the forum section of the site, or you can send me an email. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the pool.